hey guys good morning and welcome back to my channel hope you all are amazing good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you are if it's your first time here hello my name is irene welcome to my channel yeah i share health and spiritual tips if that's all you like my darling please do well hit that subscribe button make sure you turn on your notifications so you'll be notified whenever there's a new upload from me a few days ago we had a um, little issue with the bathroom water was coming from down from the ties down i recently just changed the ties so i think there was a little they didn't do it well so water was coming from the ties and somehow the water was also going downstairs so there was water everywhere so um i had to call my husband immediately my husband then called a plumber to come rectify the issue so when the plumber came to the house he came with this i don't know but the energy was just so negative i was just it was so strong i told my husband can he go i can't work with this guy please and my husband was like no let him do the work i said i can't so I was like, that thing that is happening is not good. You know, there's POP in the house. If the water is should soak the POP, it's the POP might um come down. And you know the issues we had these days with POP falling off. Just allow him to do the job and let him go. So I just had to be very patient with him. He did the job. He told me the price. He told me the amount. I didn't even price it. I just gave him the money. Be going thank you very much myself like this is the issue a lot of people are facing like you walk around with negative energy and you don't even know you are good at your job you're very good but somehow when you get there for no reason they will not give you the job someone that you are even better than they'll give that person that job and you wonder like what's happening you don't know that you are carrying negativity around. Over the years, I have taught you guys the different method how to cleanse bad energy, negativity. I'm never get, going to get tired of telling you guys this. Huh? Spirituality is a way of life. Cleansing is what you should do every now and then. Now, if you're the type of person that wherever you go to, for no reason, people hate you, for no reason, they look down on your job, for no reason, people that you are better than, they do well. Someone once, someone once messaged me, the person said, even people that I taught how to do the work, they are doing way more than me. Irene, what is going on? Now, if you don't have money to buy spiritual products, you don't have money to do spiritual work, try to do this. Go to the market. Buy snail, live snail. The snail must be live. Ask them, hope the snail is not dead. Tell them you want live snail, the one that is alive. Buy big one, very big snail. I think they say one like 3,000 or 4,000, the very big one. Take it home and remove it. Don't use something to kill it. To remove it from remove it from the shell alive. Remove it from the shell. Let you be the one. You should be the one that will remove it. Remove it from the shell. You're safe. Don't allow the shell to break. Don't break it before you remove Remove the snail itself. Don't bring the don't break the shell for you to remove the shell. No, remove the snail first. Then you go ahead and use that snail to clean your body, the whole of your body. Now there was one time I talked about snail and how it is so amazing. It has good spiritual benefit. And some people were commenting, "Oh, snail that is slow in life. Is this snail that will not make somebody to progress?" Snail that is very very slow. Ignorance is a disease, oh, like seriously. People don't like to, people don't like to read. 
People don't like to research. They just know how to follow trends. Just say this thing is bad. Another person say it's bad. Before you look, everybody will be saying it's bad, it's bad, it's bad. Without doing your own research, without finding out if this thing is really bad, Sne is very, very good when it comes to spirituality. Now, when you remove the snail from the shell, go ahead and use it to rub your body, all over your body, from your head down, everywhere. Whenever you're doing any spiritual work, your head is very important. If you want to do this, if you're carrying air like this, you have to lose it. And do it with your natural hair. Cleanse from your head like this. Use this snake to rub your head down everywhere. Leave it for a few minutes. As you are doing it, you pray. You cancel anything, any evil, any bad energy, negativity, anything at all. You cancel it from your life. You can go ahead and bathe with your normal soap. You can use sponge. Sponge your body and all that. When you're done with that, you go ahead and pound the shell of the snake. You go ahead and pound it into powder. You must pound. Don't use blender. Pound. Go to the market and buy mortar. If you are practicing spirituality, you should have mortar. Mortar pounding has its own spiritual benefits. When you're done pounding, make sure it's smooth. You can go ahead, mix it with your cream, mix it with your perfume, sprinkle it too in your bath water. You can also put little in your bag. Whenever you are going out, you that is doing um, housework, if you are a plumber, electrician, you are a makeup artist, you can go ahead and sprinkle it too in your material. Sprinkle it in that bag, that bag that you are using to go to your work. Sprinkle it to there. You go. Cleanse that negative energy from your body. So anywhere you go to, people will be like, oh, wow. When they see you, they will see lights. Know that when they see you, darkness, 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 like that plumber that came, I saw him, every dark, dark, immediately he left, I had to cleanse everywhere in my house, I had to burn incense immediately, that afternoon, I burn incense, I had to cleanse, cleanse everywhere, before the negative energy will enter me and my children, I had to cleanse everywhere, do this, don't joke with it, and always cleanse from time to time, go through my page, I've shared several cleansing methods, Pick one, you do this this week, you do another one next week, you do this this week, you do another one next week. Always cleanse. Do not joke with spirituality. Life is deeper than you think. Take your spiritual life very, very seriously. If you have any question, leave it in the comment section down below. I'm going to try my best and reply as much as I can. I'm going to see you all in my next one. Please do take care of yourself and... Stay healthy.